Hi, my name is Gator Hillard, and I'm here on behalf of Expert Village to talk today about making bread pudding with a bourbon sauce. All right, like I said earlier, you really need to break up these yolks. Uh, the three whole eggs that we put in, we still have to separate some other eggs. And basically why they want you to separate the eggs is you're going to put the yolks into there, and it's just like a binding ingredient. They use the egg, you know, for like egg wash, things like that, but they're going to use this as extra binding ingredient just to make sure that all your bread and your custard is made. So you got that mixed up pretty good. We're going to start taking these eggs. And there's like two ways that you can do it, you know. I'll show you the first way. It's like a lot of people, they'll just run it through their hand, just like that, okay? And you want to make sure you get off all that white. Just run the yolk, stick it in. And there's other ways too. You just like crack the egg, which I really don't like doing it this way, but some people do. It's more like time consuming. You just take the shell and you just keep bringing it back and forth, just like that. And you can watch like all the white. But sometimes when you do this, it might hit the shell and it breaks up your yolk and then everything's all screwed up. But we managed to make it work. So I'm gonna go back to what I was doing. And sometimes when you open up an egg, you will find blood in it. Don't use it. <laughs> it's, it's not good. And obviously you're gonna have to like wash your hands and everything. But sometimes like chicken, stuff like that, I mean, it, it's, a, it's a faulty shell. And you know what I mean? I mean, it comes to like baby chicks and stuff. So if you find blood into it, go ahead and just get rid of it because it'll make you sick. And just continue to finish mixing this up until the yolks are broken down. That's basically what you want it to look like. It's just thick, works out good. You got your extra binding ingredients in it. And you want to make sure you do all that before you move on to your next step. Make sure there's no extra lumps or, or anything like that into it. 